Hey, yo, peace, what's going on? Listen, I just want to say to y'all real quick and keep it a hundred bucks with y'all. Keep it a hundred bucks. I'm an original 1990 Detroit Motown motherfucker. Because I was out in the D in the early 1990s. You know what I mean? But the first time I came out to the D was like, I think like the middle of the 80s, like 86. You know what I mean? I was like a... I was a teenager. I want to say I was like, I was a teenager, but I didn't stay in the D that long. I came back out to New York. Then later, years later, I came on um, back out to the D in 1990. Detroit was the shit. So like I said, I was a 1990s Detroit motherfucker. Now I'm a 2019, 2020 East New York, Brooklyn motherfucker. You know what I mean? East to West, or East to Midwest, rather say. But I just wanted to share that with y'all out there. You know what I mean? Since you see my profile, I got a couple of profiles. My other profile on Facebook, you know what I mean? East New York, Brooklyn. And then this Facebook page is Detroit, Michigan as the hometown, because I used to live in the D. But that's my history as the Lord manifests. Y'all know me as the Lord Manifest. Even back then, my rapping for change, 1994, I was spitting, coming straight from New York. You know I represent. This shit goes this way, never goes your way. The shit that you talk, you know the lyrics. Flip a mad script. Lord Manifest. You know what I mean? I just wanted to spread that love and let y'all know. <coughs> Pardon me. Let y'all know the motherfucking history of the Detroit motherfucker that I used to be when I was out there. Yeah, I battled proof, rest in peace to proof. Nobody could say who won the battle. You know what I mean? Nobody could say who won the battle. Was it that motherfucker, Lord Manifest, or was it proof? You can ask anybody in Detroit that remember me, ask them who was Lord Manifest. Who was the rabbit for change motherfucker at the bus stops, on the buses and all that shit. You know what I mean? That's that's how that was back in the 90s. Detroit had a nice scene back in the 1990s and shit. You know what I mean? Detroit was like real nice, man. It was a, a good motherfucking scene back out there. And um, shit, I haven't been to Detroit, Michigan in many, many, many motherfucking years. I haven't been out to Detroit in a minute. But um, shit, as a matter of fact, I was just on um, Google Maps looking at my old strip i was like you know on google map you know how you can see like streets and shit traveling through the laptop through detroit streets i used to live on the west side of detroit on um rangoon and Tigerman. that was my street and yo what the fuck happened to all the houses it's like the house that i was living in staying in with my grandmother rest in peace it's like one house in the middle as across the street all the other houses are tore the fuck up it's like straight fucking land just green grass no houses near the house that i was living in that shit is kind of frightening yo like i don't know what the fuck is going on out there in detroit falls the mayor or what is he trying to do to build up detroit city or or, or what have you but the, the shit look fucking crazy out there man you know what I mean? The, the, I mean, the street that I used to live on is, is, you know, can't even recognize it, man. But the house that I lived in is still there, but it, it looks so fucking crazy on that street. Like, no houses, only one house, and the whole shit is land, man. It's like, if you stand in that crib, if I were to go back, let's say if I were to go back and that crib was open and I want to buy it or stay in it, I have to have mad protection. Because anybody could fucking try to break in that crib out there in Detroit, man. You know what I mean? But anyway, I just wanted to share that with y'all. You know what I mean? I'm a 1990s Detroit motherfucker. That is now 2019, 2020, East New York, Brooklyn motherfucker. You know what I mean? Midwest to East Coast, East Coast to Midwest. You know what I mean? But I just want to spread that love. Rest in peace to Hot Song. You know what I mean? He claimed to be a New York motherfucker. Rest in peace to Proof. And rest in peace to my brother K-Funk. I want to send a shout out to Slum Village. 
You know what I mean? Because I used to be up in that high school, um, Persian. First, I used to, you know, be in McKenzie High School and all that and shit. Shout out to Dope Adelic. Shout out to a lot of motherfuckers that knew me out in the D and motherfuckers that I bumped into that see me in New York. Like, oh shit, that motherfucker's really from NY. He's out here. All that bullshit, that dumb shit. But anyways, salute. Happy holidays. Peace.